HMD Global unveiled the Nokia 8 a few months ago and more recently the Nokia 7, but the Finnish manufacturer is once again turning its attention to the entry-level segment with the Nokia 2. The Nokia 2 is positioned below the Nokia 3, and is the most affordable Android-based handset rolled out by HMD yet. In that video, you are going to discover the Nokia 2 in depth. While the Nokia 2 doesn't have a lot going for it in terms of raw hardware, the design is a cut above what you'd normally find in this segment. The phone is milled out of 6000 series aluminum, just like its costlier siblings. HMD says that the 5-inch 720 by 1280 pixels panel is the best in this category. It looks promising. With the Nokia 2, you will get a 8 megapixels rear camera with autofocus and LED flash. On the screen, you can enjoy the Nokia 2 in both colors variants, copper black and pewter white. It looks really nice. Aside from running stock Android 7.0 Nougat, which is a highlight on its own, Nokia also boasted that the Nokia 2 is the first entry-level device with Google Assistant on deck. It also takes a page of the Pixels book and comes with unlimited video and photo storage in Google Photos, which should alleviate the pain of the measly native storage. Preloaded with a collection of Indian languages and local dialects, the handset is obviously targeted at the large Indian smartphone market, but this does not mean you won't be able to get it elsewhere. The Nokia 2 comes with HMD Global's promise of monthly security updates as well as an upgrade to Android 8.0 Oreo. A very good point for the Nokia 2. The Nokia 2 is the first Android phone to be powered by the Snapdragon 212 platform. The chipset is built on the 28 nanometers node, and offers four 1.3 GHz Cortex-A7 cores. Qualcomm says that there are 2 billion feature phone in the world, with the Snapdragon 212 aimed at those looking to make the switch to a smartphone for the first time. The Nokia 2 doesn't look particularly strong when it comes to the specs offering just 1 GB of RAM and 8 GB of internal storage. That said, HMD Global has shown that it is great at optimizing its budget devices, so we'll reserve judgment until we use the Nokia 2 for an extended duration of time. Other details include a massive 4100 mAh battery. The large 4100 mAh battery at the rear of the handset will offer you at least two days of battery life. In its category of devices, the Nokia 2 is the better in the battery domain. On the front, you will get a 5 megapixels fixed focus front camera. It will be great for your selfies with friends. To resume the specifications, with the Nokia 2, you will get at an affordable price. Android 7.1.1 Nougat stock experience with a promise to get Android 8.0 Oreo quickly in 2018. A 5 inches HD 720 by 1280 pixels LCD display with a Corning Gorilla Glass 3 treatment. The new 1.3 GHz Qualcomm Snapdragon 212 with just 1 GB of RAM. The internal storage is just 8 GB expandable up to 128 GB via micro SD card. A 8 megapixels rear camera and a 5 megapixels front camera. A large battery of 4100 mAh which will let your Nokia 2 to stay in life at least two days. Priced at 99 euros or 115 dollars, the Nokia 2 is available in three color combinations, pewter black, pewter white, and copper black, and will go on sale starting mid-November. The company has not shared country-specific availability details, those will be shared closer to the sales but has specified that both single SIM and dual SIM variants will be available according to the market. The Nokia 2 packs in modest specifications, but like other Nokia devices, the pitch is about the pure Android experience rather playing on the specification sheet. Is that a right call? Let us know your thoughts and comments. To discover more Nokia and Android related content, don't hesitate to subscribe to the S Sorrels channel.